with us being married. My credit is terrible. So you had to buy the house and put it in your name. But we did buy it while we were married. When everything's going bad, can you kick me out because the house is in your name? No. In Massachusetts, it doesn't matter whether your name is on the deed for the house, on the mortgage for the house or not. If it's purchased during the marriage, it's a marital asset. A judge isn't typically going to say, yes, you have to get out of the house. You can't pick a party out of the house regardless of whether their name is on the house or not. It's also seen as your residence at that place. Does it change at all if you owned the house before we got married and then I moved in? As far as being able to kick the spouse out during the divorce process, it doesn't change that aspect of it just because you own the house. If it was your home that you're living in, it will change what your equitable interest in that property. And instead of looking at the entire value of the house and the equity, the court at that point is likely to look at what the increase in equity is since the time you were there if you were contributing to the house. And there's a lot more factors that go into it, but your interest would be the house was purchased during the marriage, but it doesn't change your ability to continue to reside in the house, even with the other party saying, get out of the house, it's my house.